So guys, in today's video, I have a lot of things to talk about. There is gonna be a new robot, a new drone, and also a new titan. In this video, I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know. Some of the things that are gonna be on this weekend's test server. So, without further ado, let's start. Let's see what exactly we have. So, first of all, guys, we are on Robots Official. Page Robots 9.0 update notes so you can get inside as well this is oh, the official uh site robot site you know most of the things you already know you know about them the robot the links the needle spike and stake so uh this week probably the event is gonna start they're gonna activate the event and most of the things they're gonna be there the battleship the roulette the Kest kestrel the catty cat uh, something I cannot say, uh, I cannot read this name, whatever. Special editions, paint jobs. So you can read it by yourself, guys. You already know about most of this stuff, they already mentioned it on their videos. I just want to say some, I, I want to highlight the important stuff that you don't know about. So the first thing they all they already mentioned that, but I need to say something about it. There is gonna be a pilot for the Fafnir. A legendary pilot for the Fafnir, of course I'm gonna test it, I will have it, I will test it. So basically the built-in weapons gain plus 35% penetration, Fafnir's durability is reduced by 15%. So of course I'm really curious to test it out, when I will have it, I will release a video. Also with the links, with the catty and everything. So the balance changes, the angler, I already mentioned that. One of my recent videos, uh, uh, the Angler, the Seraph, the Capri, the Claw, the Spear. But there is some things that I didn't mention and I didn't know about. Now I, we know. The Ao Chin, the Ao Gwen, they are gonna, they are buffing the Ao Chin and the Ao Gwen. The built-in weapons damage plus 50% of the Ao Chin. The Ao Gwen, flight speed modificator, you can see the numbers. The Dragoon, uh, Dragoon. Hussars at Marquez, damage per shot plus 10%, Thermite, Kibera, they are getting another uh, 10%, Gauss, Volt and Weber, another buff, wow, they buffed them so many times, the Ion, another uh, plus 15% extra damage, so guys, this is not the important stuff, I mentioned in the beginning there is going to be a new Obat, new Titan, so let's see, let's go, so First of all, this is the picture of the new drone. Guys, this is taken from the test server. So this is probably going to be on this weekend's test server. The name of the drone is Showdown. So it says here, drone's abilities on stealth drop damage. We'll have stealth abilities on medium damage heal. So I'm guessing after taking a certain amount of damage, we'll get healing. And while stealth speed, I cannot... We cannot really know what exactly it's gonna be, but we'll get speed, stealth, and no critics. I, I cannot, I cannot understand what it, they said here, but I can say for sure that it's gonna be a stealth drone. We'll give you ho also healing and some speed. That's what I can tell from this thing. And let's go for the the new robot. So there you go, guys. This is the new robot from the test server. Unfortunately we cannot see the design the name of the robot is crisis and pay attention four heavy weapons kang day it's an heavy weapon four heavy weapons guys so the behemoth is not going to be the only one robot the only one that has four heavy weapons this thing will have also four heavy weapons and it's going to be probably on this weekend's test server the name is crisis and it's going to have stealth you can see the ability the Corporation Icarus Technologies abilities overpower. For a short time, significantly increases the outcoming damage of the robot and grant a shield breaker effect. What the heck? Are you kidding me? Stealth also has stealth. Passive has two modes. Passive has stealth. The robot, the robot is constantly in stealth mode. What? It is impossible to target the robot. Because it disappeared from the enemy radars and guidance systems. Any action other than moving and turning tower disables invincibility. Invisibility and sets the ability to recharge. Wow, are you kidding me? And there is, uh, I can see also, the cooldown is 5 seconds. I can see also there is a new weapon here. 
for Reaper. Reaper, it's probably a new weapon. So, you see, recommended equipment for Reaper. Oh my god, so many stuff. Oh, they have new stuff on the live server. It's gonna be on this, probably this weekend's test server. Bonus damage. 125 extra damage. 125% extra damage. What heck is that? Guys, are you kidding me? 3 seconds ability duration. 3 seconds ability duration. So this is for the overpower ability. You get extra damage. Something like this run guy, I'm guessing. The cooldown is 10 seconds. And this is the durability of this thing. 60 kph. Too fast. Wow. You see, for a short time, significantly increase the outcoming damage of the robot and got shield breaker effect. So let me understand. We have stealth. You will have 4 heavy weapons, 125% extra damage when he is going to activate the overpower ability. And again, 4 heavy weapons. What the heck is that? Guys, this is going to be the new ultimate overpowered robot in the game. The crisis. We need to wait. We need to wait and see the test server. And this is not, not the end. There is more. The new titan, there is also a new titan. This is the information of the new titan again. I don't have a picture of this thing. The DSC engineers have combined their entire spectrum of in, you know, active technologies in protection and speed. This is the information about him. Putting it all in a massive shell, titan is equally good at attacking opponents and defense. Thanks to its unique air dash, Titan can travel a long distance and bring it its entire mass down to on and the enemy. Modified shields help him survive. Also will have shields. Help him survive under fire. If his physical shields are destroyed, can teleport himself. A whole new set of shields and continue the fight. Interesting. Abilities cast clean. The Titan rises to, to a fixed height and hangs in flight. If there is an enemy in Titan's side, the, side, the Titan rushes directly at the enemy's position when it, uh, the ability is activated again. If there is no enemy in range, activating the ability again will allow the Titan to fly a certain distance through, toward the direction of the aim. If the ability is not reactivated, the, the, the Titanium will drop. Okay. When, a, when a Titan strikes an enemy or falls to the ground it activates a power field around it which throws robots deals damage and causes suppression also have suppression of course of course another titan with suppression affecting a radius the radius of the power field 100 meter maximum distance for the dash to target 500 meter there i have more the, uh, pictures suppression you know what it means temporary reduce the damage of all enemies Enemies 75%. Shields replacement after a little preparation, the Titan explodes all of its built-in undestroyed physical shields. So this is something, something different that we never saw before. We need to see exactly what how it's gonna be on the desert level. But for each shield destroyed, the Titan repairs a portion of its durability. After destroying the Titan, teleports new shields with full durability. So many abilities. I'm so confused already. <laughs> So many abilities, and there is, I see also, there is gonna be a new Titan, new Titan weapons. Argon, Oxy. This is too much, so many new stuff. What is happening, Pixonic? What is, what is going on here? The durability, you can see durability, 650k durability, 35%. What is that? Uh, I don't know, 40k pH. Let's see, I have more pictures. So this is, again, you can see doesn't have uh, unfortunately it doesn't have the design we'll have two beta weapons and one alpha like the kid and you can see shields replacement castling there is more the titan you can you can see this already this this the same thing i said before the abilities teleports teleporting new physical shields <laughs> this is different something entirely new so they have uh, we'll have the module slots we'll have one assault, two defense, one universal. So you can put, for example, you can put two uh, repair. Uh, we can you put one repair amplifier, two Titan uh, anti-control, and one anti-matter reactor. For example, I'm just 
saying something. This is it, guys. There is a new... The Crisis Robot, four heavy weapons, stealth, new Titan, and new Titan weapons as well, new weapon, new drone, the stuff already we have on the live server, the event hasn't started yet. There is already a test server this weekend's test server probably. This, these pictures, they are taken from the test server, guys, it was open for a short period of time. These screenshots were taken from there. The test server itself is still closed, I'm guessing. But it will be open probably this weekend, Saturday. And the stuff, they will be there. The new Titan, the new robot, the new stuff. Tell me what you think about that, guys. Uh, if you want to see more content like that, subscribe. Click the bell, smash the like. There is also the giveaway right now. I'm hosting a giveaway of us. the Sirius Titan. Sirius Titan and also the Veyron weapon. Be sure to check it out. And... Until next time, have a good day, stay snipe.